Thanks for hanging with me today, Hex. It's always a blast to go hard in the paint with you. The feeling is mutual, player. However, I have noticed your passing accuracy has decreased by 18.6% since last week. Is there something bothering you? I'm just thinking about my date with girlfriend tonight. We're gonna go stargazing at the edge of the city. The weather's gonna be perfect. I can't wait. Whoops! Uh, sorry, Hex. Are you hurt? My transmission receptors appear to be damaged. Is that, um, expensive to fix? Extremely. But don't worry, I know you're good for it. Dang it! Incoming video call from girlfriend. Ooh, pick up, pick up! Hey, girlfriend! Hey, player! I'm just calling to say, I think... Hold on, I can't hear you. We're breaking up! What? I can't understand you. We have a bad connection. Bad connection? We're perfectly in sync, babe. I like rap battling. You like rap battling. We both have freakishly deformed body proportions. What else does a couple need to be happy? I'm gonna go. She... She hung up. Hex, how could she do this to me? I thought we were in love. Player, you know I am a machine, capable of analyzing all the evidence and coming to a rational conclusion. According to my calculations, you two are officially broken up. And also, she hates you now. No! No! This can't be the end! Hex, how do I win her back? Do I look like a girl expert to you, player? Honestly, uh, kind of. You're great at b-ball and dress fly all the time. You must get all kinds of chicks. I have no time for love. Ball is life. Plus, I hypothesize it takes more than fly clothes and sick b-ball skills to maintain a proper relationship. Good point. I need real help. And I know just the people to talk to. Senpai! Monica? Where is everybody? Don't tell me they're all in class. Hey! Hmm? Sorry to interrupt your PDA fest, but I need your help. Nice to see you too, player. And it's not PDA if there's no one else here, is it? I'm here. Then get lost. This is our private date spot where we come to sing the extra saucy duets. Don't we, sweetie? We sure do, Snookums. Okay, TMI much? Also, shouldn't you be in school or something? <laughs> player. Why would anyone in a relationship do anything besides singing and writing poetry with their true love? Can you imagine being single? How lonely that must feel. <laughs> <laughs> How can we help you, player? Girlfriend broke up with me. Ouch. Can't say I didn't see it coming. I need some help. Monica, can you make her like me again? Oh, I'm not sure I can do that. What do you mean? You're the queen of manipulation. You glitch people out of existence just to be with the one you love. Not anymore. Real, passionate love comes naturally, player. It does indeed. Ew, who cares? Just go inside girlfriend's brain or whatever and make her like me. Or glitch me back in time and give me another chance. No can do. I was in a dark place then. I like who I am now. So do I. I like you more. <sighs> Fine, I'll leave you two then. You know, player, if you're lonely... Duets get boring now and then. We need a nice whiny soprano. And we do love your vibe. If you'd like, we could form a trio. Uh... Stupid girlfriend and her stupid breakup. Stupid feelings. I wish I could just be chill all the time, like... Like... Garcello! Garcello, wake up! You're the chillest, coolest person I know! Girlfriend broke up with me and it really hurts. I want to be chill like you and not feel anything. You got any pointers? Oh, right. You're such a good listener. For a second, I forgot you were dead. Man, this sucks. I just need some advice. Don't cry, little man. I'm here for you. Garcello, I'm so glad you're back. This breakup stinks. I just want to be mellow like you so I won't feel bad. Help me out, bro. Listen, when I was alive, I thought it was always best to be aloof and non-committal. All I cared about was smoking and relaxing. People used to call me a wayward spirit, and I thought that was pretty tight. But now look at me, man. I'm a literal wayward spirit, and it's not all it's cracked up to be. 
While you're alive, you gotta live, dude. You gotta feel the good stuff and the bad stuff too. You understand? <laughs> yeah. Thanks for coming down from the heavens just to give me bro advice. No problem, little man. Also, no one buried my body, so I'm kind of doomed to haunt this alley for eternity. Oh, bummer. It's not all bad. There's a ghost McDonald's right down the street. Are ghost McDonald's any different from regular McDonald's? The ice cream machine is never broken. Dude, lucky. Well, might as well enjoy the stars tonight, even if I'll be by myself. <sighs> Maybe this was a bad idea. Girlfriend? Hello, player. Hex, what are you doing here? I ran many empathy simulations to project your emotional state and concluded that... I don't speak computer, Hex. I was worried about you. How are you feeling? Bad. I just want things to be like they were. But Monica said I can't make girlfriend like me, and Garcello's ghost said I have to feel stuff even if I don't want to. So I guess I'm stuck feeling like garbage forever. You will not feel like garbage forever, player. How do you know? Because, player, not even Friday Night Funkin' will last forever. Eventually, the updates will cease, and the game will come to an end. Why would you say that? Friday Night Funkin' is my life! I'm trying to feel better! Yes. And your time in Friday Night Funkin' is too precious to spend all of it down in the dumps. Eventually, you will have fun rap battles again. What's the point of even playing this game anymore if it'll all just disappear someday? Like girlfriend. Look up at the stars, player. Even the stars do not last forever. Some of them are already gone. Okay, your point is? They are still beautiful. They're painting on a background for the game, Hex. Don't overthink it. You are ruining the moment. Fine. So, what you're saying is, even though Friday Night Funkin' can be happy and sad, and doesn't last forever, and doesn't have girlfriend, that it's still worth playing? Correct. You know what? You're right, Hex. Thank you. I mean it this time. Oh, great. Who is it now? Hey, guys. My awkwardness meters indicate that I should leave you two alone. Goodbye. <laughs> Bye, Hex. Ah, you sure picked a great spot for tonight. Sorry I'm late, by the way. We were getting coffee and the barista spelled Witty's name wrong. He blew up at her, literally. I don't understand. Why are you here? What do you mean? I wouldn't miss our date for the world, player. Oh, and sorry for the bad reception earlier. Bad reception? We're breaking up. I'm gonna go. Oh, breaking up, like the signal. Yeah, something went wrong with the call, I think. Oh, well, water under the bridge, right? Water under the bridge. 